And with the 102nd overall pick in their first pick in the 2022 NFL Draft, the Miami Dolphins are taking Channing Tindall, linebacker from Georgia. And Tindall is just an absolute missile. I mean, this dude, you look at his spider chart in his athletic testing, 95th percentile broad jump, 98th percentile vertical jump, 95th percentile 40 time. That 40 time, by the way, is a 447, 87th percentile 10 yard split, 97th percentile hand size. I mean, just a really freakish athlete in terms of straight line linear speed. Uh, that being said, coverage is going to be an issue. This is a guy who was not a starter for Georgia, despite the fact that he played significant snaps. He's not a guy who usually played very often on third down. So you're going to have some trouble with coverage. Uh, he's still very much learning how to play football as a linebacker at an elite level because he is very underdeveloped. And in terms of snaps in college, he has one year with more than 100 defensive snaps in college this past season. That's it. Never played more than 100 defensive snaps in the season in his career besides that. So he's still very much learning the position. It's a guy you have to be very patient with. He struggles to stay connected to the players in pass coverage. That might never change because he is a little tight in space. That being said, he's a see ball, go get ball kind of guy. He is a missile on a straight line. He was never penalized in college. He rarely misses tackles. And he, you know what? You can use him as a blitzer as well. He produced over 20 pressures this past year. And because of his speed and range, he has sideline to sideline range, elite closing speed, really good pursuit to, pursuit to even out race his own teammates. Uh, and he was even more explosive, I say, and, and faster than Jacoby Dean and Quay Walker quite easily. So this is a good pickup for the Miami Dolphins.